ஹரே கிருஷ்ணா வெல்கம் டு கிருஷ்ணா ஸ்கியூசின் ஐ ஆம் பூவன் சுந்தரி ராதா தேவிதாசி வித் அன் அமேசிங் ரெசிபி டுடே வி வில் மேக் ஹோல் வீட் பிட்டா பிரெட் வித்வுட் யூசிங் ஈஸ்ட் அண்ட் ஓவன் ஸோ வி வாண்ட் பி ஆடிங் ஆல் பர்பஸ் ஃப்ளோர் ரெதர் மேக் யூசிங் வீட் ஃப்ளோர் தஸ் இட் இஸ் ட்ரூலி ஹெல்தி அண்ட் அ ஃபென்டாஸ்டிக் ரெசிபி so let's get started first let's take a mixing bowl into this add 2 cups of wheat flour and add salt to taste 1 tablespoon sugar add half teaspoon baking soda 1 teaspoon baking powder and on it add half cup of curd and give a gentle stir to the curd wait for few seconds and now you can see the bubbles have appeared this is what we need Now combine well. I want to make healthy, so I am using wheat flour. But if you want, you can use all-purpose flour also. Combine the curd evenly. These pita bread are also known as khubus. Actually, these are made in oven using yeast. But today we will make it without oven and yeast. it has mixed well next we will add 1 tablespoon of oil and give it a good mix further add lukewarm water which is very important do not use normal water we will add it and knead a dough you can see we added no yeast add some more water and knead a medium soft dough you can see the dough we need to knead this dough continuously for 5 to 6 minutes until the dough smoothen after 5 minutes of kneading you can see the dough has smoothen and also see its texture now add 1 tablespoon of oil and knead it again for half a minute our dough is perfect and ready moreover apply some oil on the dough Now cover it with a lid and place it aside for 3 hours. It has been 3 hours. Let's check it. You can observe the dough has increased in size. Let's give it a final lid. And with this the dough is ready. Next make medium sized ball Keep folding it in So there are no cracks on top I will show you one more Just fold it down 
Similarly, make all the balls. Next, sprinkle some floor on the workspace. Place a ball coated with floor and roll it into a medium thick chapati. I have rolled it. It is ready. I will roll one more chapati. I have listed down all the ingredients below in the description box. You can refer it. It is also ready. Now we will place it on a heated tawa. Let the flame be low. Do not disturb until few bubbles appear. You can see few bubbles. Now flip the chapati carefully. Flip it again. And now increase the flame to high and let it cook. You can see it's coming up wonderfully. This is really good. Flip it again and cook. Amazing. This has cooked well. Let's take it out. Similarly, I will show you one more. Place the chapati on hot tawa. The bubbles have appeared. Flip it again and cook. Flip it again and cook. They are coming up without any difficulty. And these are fab. Pita bread is a Middle Eastern flat bread that puffs when baked creating an air pocket in middle. As it cools, it deflates and flatten but the pocket remains. This is ready. Take it out. Our pita bread is ready. Let me cut and show you. You can see here, the pocket is still here. Amazing! It has cooked so well from in and it has come out perfectly. I will share some recipes like falafel, tahini sauce related to pita bread in the coming videos. Pita bread is ready. Let's place a tulsi leaf and offer to Lord Jagannath. Our soft and healthy pita breads are ready. Stay tuned. If you like Puka recipes, please like, share, subscribe and click on the bell icon below so you do not miss any Puka recipe. Hare Krishna, Hare Bull.